My name's Neil Oakley from Cares of Crover, we're a VW Audi specialist, but we also do classic cars and modification. Now, this is a TD21 Series 2 Elvis. Um, now, among one of the many modifications we've done to this vehicle is installation of a Rover V8 engine. Now, Elvis did make one prototype, but it never actually made it to production. Uh, we fitted here a 4 litre Rover V8 as found in uh, many cars since the 60s and this one actually came out of a Range Rover and we've done a lot of modifications to this including inlet manifold, carburetor, cam shafts, exhaust and uh, ignition system. And this also runs a Kenlo fan to keep things cool the, although the original radiator is quite up to the job. Now we fit a 5 speed gearbox to this, uh, nothing new for an Alvis, this vehicle did actually have a 5 speed from new. Um, now one of the other modifications we've done is a left hand drive conversion uh, as per customer's instructions. Now, along with this we've fitted a power assisted steering rack. Now, this vehicle was fitted with a steering box system from you which was a little bit vague to say but the least. This is now rack and pinion that was a lot more positive on the road. As well as modifications to the engine and running gear we've also uh, done some changes to the interior of the vehicle. As you can see it's not finished yet, some of the parts have been trimmed in leather and they'll be back with a seat to be refitted. The main centre dash panel was a lot larger on the original vehicle. We've actually made this one from scratch, but to show kind of similarity to the original, you don't want to change things too much. Now this is, uh, this is a ply backed uh, dashboard with a burnt oak laminate over the top of that and then it's been lacquered to give it the finish that it has. This vehicle uh, is a 1960s Jaguar E-Type, it's a Series 2, and it's brought into us for restoration. Uh, a lot of repairs made to this vehicle, mainly new floor sections, inner and outer seals, rear wheel arches, front and rear valances, and uh, a complete repaint. Uh, as you can see the vehicle is totally stripped, so other bits and pieces would have been sent off uh, plating, powder coating and so on and then will be shortly refitted. This has had its first coat of paint, this will then be blocked back, there will be another coat of red and then a, a coat of black to protect that. And hopefully this will be ready in spring. So to finish, my name is Neil Oakley from caresofcrobra.co.uk and if you have any questions then please email inquiries at caresofcrobra.co.uk Thank you.